Oh! I haven't spoken like all day, so. Eee! Eee! My voice nodules are not working. Anyways, hi guys! It is me, Jordan Byers, and today we are gonna be brutally, honestly reviewing the brand new, well, this is just not brand brand new. I'm like kind of behind a little bit, but y'all wanted this. This is the Patrick Star and Matt collection, the summer star collection. Okay, so this little set is $49.50. It is complete with an entire face that includes a bronzing powder, two lip gloss shades, and an eyeshadow quad? Quad, yeah, there's four and an eyeshadow quad. So, first of all, I'm not really a fan of the packaging. Like, you guys know I did not like Patrick's powder when he came out with it. It just didn't work on my super dry skin. It was just too drying and I was not about it. Um, and I kind of got roasted to filth for not liking his packet or for not liking his powder. But you guys know I'm always gonna be honest with you whether I like a product or not. I personally freaking love Patrick Star. I think he's hilarious. I think he is an iconic um, influencer in the beauty industry and he is such an inspiration. But just because I like somebody and what they're doing doesn't mean I'm going to like their product. And of course, I'm not gonna tell you guys false information or false opinions. So, <clears throat> when we're talking about this summer collection, it comes in this little box. They give you like a little face sheet or whatever this is called. I don't know what it's called, I'm sorry. And then they have the products individually wrapped in the inside. So I just, hey, packaging is one of those things like some people will love it, some people will hate it. It's all personal preference type of thing. I'm just not really into the whole Chevron thing. It's just not really my thing, but hey, that's just me. Um, if I wasn't doing a review on this collection, I most definitely wouldn't have gotten it just because I'm not into this kind of packaging. I feel it looks kind of cheap, but the product could be bomb and that's all that really matters. So don't get mad at me for saying I don't like the packaging. I mean, everybody has their own personal preferences on packaging, okay, okay? Anyways, let's talk firstly about the Give Me Life bronzing powder. It says on Ulta.com that it contains light reflecting bronzing pigments, provides a natural sun-kissed look, and is for a wide variety of skin tones. So let's look at the color of this. I mean, it looks like a typical bronzer color, maybe a little bit dark for my skin tone, but we're gonna be using a very light hand because I don't wanna mess this one up. <laughs> Let's just go ahead and use it. Right. Oh wow, there's a lot of kickback. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, but it's dark. I'm using a fluffier brush. Ooh, this is really pretty. Guys, this is freaking beautiful. Look at that. So this is with the contour, bronzer, whatever, and this is without. <sighs> I'm obsessed. Beautiful and it's blending like a dream. <sighs> so, uh, yes, this bronzer is freaking everything. I'm obsessed with it. It's blending so beautifully and the color is perfect. <laughs> I like this a lot. I like that a lot. All right, so now that the skin is snatched, honey, snatched, like, do you see the highlight? Like, do you s <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I'm so feeling, okay, I got my hair cut today, like, it's, it's, it's short again, and I got it toned and everything, so it's like the perfect cool toned color, and I'm freaking obsessed, and I'm just like feeling myself, like, eee! <laughs> Anyways, let's continue. This is what it looks like on the inside. I don't hate this packaging. Um, I like the teal better than, or like this aqua blue better than 
the like pink and orange. Like I like this color combo better than this color combo, but that's just me being picky. I'm sorry, moving on. Um, I just feel like this, it doesn't match. Like the packaging and the product doesn't match. You know what I mean? Like, oh, okay, moving on. Let's actually try this on. This is what the quad looks like. So it looks like we're gonna be doing a smoky brown look with a little pop of red in there. So let's just, let's do that. Let's do that. But I need to start off, of course, every single time with my P. Louise base. And of course I use it wet. I don't set it or anything. We just leave it wet and it's perfect. So like always, I take my statement color, which in this case is gonna be this chocolate brown right here, on this orange stained Juno brush and I'm just going to place this in the crease where I know I'm going to blend it out real cute. You guys know this is how I always do it. And then I'm going to take this peachy color, peachy tan color right here, and I'm gonna blend out the edge. Okay, so I'm gonna take that same chocolate brown color and bring it down to the lower lash line, like so. And then over top of that, to kind of do the same effect on the top and bottom, I'm taking the tan shade and just blending that out and kind of making it more of a gradient, more smoky. So I really want to take the red color in this palette and put it on my lower inner corner like this right there. It's so pretty. It's, like meta it's metallic red. It reminds me of the shade in the Kat Von D side of the heart with Too Faced, the collab palette. She had a red just like this on her side and I loved it to death. I'm just gonna like place this right there and blend it into the brown shade. So I took this small little pencil brush and kind of dragged the red right underneath where the inner corner is just to kind of make it look my, like my eyes are a little bit bigger than they are. Cause then I'm taking this sleek palette. This is my favorite highlighter ever and I just recently got back into it because ugh, I don't know it was hiding my collection but I wiped off the brush and I'm gonna take this gold color right here it's so blinding and I'm just going to enhance that inner corner with that that is that so using the last color in this quad I'm taking this brown or copper metallic color and I'm gonna wet my brush because I have a feeling like, actually, let's try it dry first. I'm gonna take a flat synthetic brush and just pick up, oh, shoot, maybe you don't need to wet it. Damn. Oh, shoot, I can't get this on here, okay, oops. And I'm just going to, oh my gosh. Oh. You don't need to wet it, you don't, you don't need to wet it. Nope, you don't. Oh my gosh, wow. Holy moly, I would buy this. I would buy this just for that copper shade. Holy crap, whoa. Wow, this is a good makeup day. This is a really good makeup day. This is a really good makeup day, like really good. Okay, so now that the eyes are done, the face is looking snatched, let's talk about the two lip glass products we have here. Okay, so this pink one, it's not pink pink, it's like a pink toned nude. This is called Cream Pie. And then this more tan colored nude is called Fashion Punch. So here we go, Cream Pie and Fashion Punch. Let's just use both. Let's just like, let's just ombre it up right now. Like that's, that's what we're gonna do. I decided, I decided that's what we're gonna do. Going in with Fashion Punch first. And then on the center, I'm gonna put cream pie. I was literally, can I be honest with you guys? Well, 
I'm always honest with you guys. I was not expecting for this to turn out this good. Like, I was not expecting to be so into this look because I was really turned off by the packaging. But, like, the way... I got an email. Anyways. The way that this pulled together and all the colors worked together, I'm like, holy freaking moly. This is bomb. Oh. So, obviously, for the price point of $50, and you get four things and every single one of them is really freaking good quality and the colors just all go so well together. I'm shocked. Like, I wasn't expecting to like it this much. But it's really freaking good. I really like that. Anyways, I guess that's my review is I am really down for it. $50 for four products that all work seamlessly together, but then of course you can all use them separately as well. But first of all, the bronzer is beautiful. The obviously lip glasses are lip glasses and they're just already, they're just already amazing. Um, this eyeshadow, holy crap, I would buy the eyeshadow quad just for that freaking copper shade. <sighs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I had so much fun trying out this little collection. It started out a little rough and then it got really, really positive by the end. So that was a really great turn of events. Thank you guys again for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Just know that I love you so much. Okay? Okay? Okay, bye!